Is the cure to laziness finding a husband? I don't know. I don't know. Do you know? <laughs> laziness is a virtue. Or is that patience is a virtue? Let's talk about laziness today. <laughs> All right. Laziness, that's a, that's a fun one. And yes, I'm holding my camera today because, just because, I don't need a reason. I'm holding my camera. I'm in my living room now, so who here is lazy? <laughs> I am. Uh, I, I wanna say, I wanna blame it on singleness, to be honest with you, the laziness. <sighs> Cause you know, I've been single, y'all know five years plus, almost six years now. And I want to say that being single for so long has somehow built laziness in my life. Uh, I, I like watching TV, like a lot, maybe too much. Yeah, laziness is a part of my life now, and it's not something that I like, obviously, but it's a comfort that I've developed. And I don't know how to get out of it. I keep telling myself, oh, once I find a boyfriend, once I find a partner, a husband, that will be dealt with. I won't be lazy anymore because I'll be doing something with this person. I'll be doing activities and going for walks and stuff like that. So, but that's an excuse. I can go for walks on my own. I can do these activities on my own. I can obviously not play board games on my own, but you know. I don't believe finding a husband is the cure for anything, anything. I believe everything that you are before marriage only amplifies in marriage. So, <laughs> I don't know. If I'm lazy now and I get married, am I going to be 10 times more lazy? I think I think finding a husband will help a little bit with the laziness issue just because unless I get a lazy husband then we're super doomed. But I believe that together we will have more desire to do things to 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 to, you know, be together and experience things together and stuff like that. So I do believe a partner will help on the laziness issue. I mean, it's obvious, isn't it? Is it wrong for me to think that? I could find things to do on my own because there are things that single people can do on their own. They don't need people. But... I think that falls into me not being completely independent as well. I'm not an independent person to begin with. I don't like doing things on my own. I don't like shopping on my own. I don't like, I don't like going for walks on my own. I, I don't like to do anything alone. So I don't know if that's called a lack of independence or I'm not codependent, but it's more like I, I prefer doing things with people. I don't know. So because I'm on my own and I, all my friends are married with kids and I only have one or two friends that are single, but they they live far. Uh, instead of going for walks on my own, instead of doing things on my own, I sit on my own bottom and I watch TV. So call that laziness? Sure. Is any of you single people used to be extroverted that became introverted because of the long period of singleness or have you experienced this type of laziness or let me know in the comments below what you're going through in involving laziness have you developed a comfort in laziness have you started justifying laziness like I'm doing right now. So that's the thing. How to overcome laziness in a period of extended singleness. I don't know, I don't have the answer, do you? 
when it comes to activities, when it comes to doing uh, like shopping, getting out of my house, I guess I could say. Yeah, things outside of my house. I'm lazy with that stuff. Things inside of my house, no problem. I'll do stuff. <laughs> I'll clean. I'll cook. I'll bake. Um, I'll I'll do arts. I'll create things. I'll I'll sit on my patio and read a book. You know, I'll do a lot of things in my house. But when it comes to outside of my house, maybe I'm gonna blame the pandemic. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? There's a good there's a good justification. It's the pandemic's fault. But I can't really use that completely because I've been like this way before the pandemic. So, but I'll blame the pandemic for making it comfortable. Yeah, because the pandemic gave me a justification for these things to stay home. You know, I have to stay home. No problem. You know, it was like a, it was a good thing for me. <laughs> yeah, so the pandemic made me introverted because I'm a huge believer in this quote everything you've ever wanted is right outside your comfort zone but now it's like my comfort zone has become bigger my zone has expanded I don't know what to do about that is a husband or boyfriend or partner or whatever the key to unlocking this mystery? I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna try to make my videos a little bit more interesting from now on. You know, like different sceneries, uh, different noises, different editing. I need to expand on my editing skills. Yes, I know. <laughs> hey, I blame it on laziness. Huh? Huh? There's a good one. I welcome your your feedback on this to see if uh, I'm I'm just like I don't know in denial. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, laziness, yay! So let me know if you have any questions. Comment in the section below. And that's it for today. Thanks for listening. Bye.